Have you ever felt like your bike is working against you instead of for you? Then maybe pedal kickback could be one reason. Our DGDF technology offers you additional degrees of freedom by minimizing the influence of pedal kickback on your full suspension bike. It's easy adjustable, it comes with low maintenance uh, and it doesn't add any additional weight to your bike. So imagine you're riding on a rough trail, uh, like on your home trail with lots of roots and rocks uh, and therefore also heavy impacts. In those moments, the effect of pedal kickback could occur on your full suspension bike. The DF system allows the free up to rotate a specific range before engaging so that the influence on the rear suspension is reduced. That allows the rear triangle to work more freely and provide you in the end with more control, balance and also less fatigue on the trail. The cool thing about the system is also that you have the freedom to find the right setup for different types of terrain or bike without any special tools. The DF system is compatible with every Ratchet DEG equipped hub. So you can basically convert your regular DEG hub with our upgrade kit into this anti-pedal kickback hub with 90 teeth engagement and three different adjustment options. We also see the importance and influence of e-mountain biking. Uh, that's why we also like, developed a specific hybrid e-bike version of our DF system that is also ready for all high torque bikes in the market and it comes with 60 teeth engagement and two adjustment options. The DF technology offers you three easily adjustable anti-pedal kickback setup options. The zero degree setup provides you with the reactivity of a normal high engagement hub as you already know it from the DEG hub that we have. It is ideally suited to riding where free up engagement speed is key and pedal kickback isn't that strong. The 10 degree setting for the DF system is in our opinion the perfect sweet spot for especially trail or all mountain riding. Um, so where you have a big variety of different trail conditions that could occur and where pedal kickback could also be an influence on your bike. Coming to the 20 degree option, uh, here you, you will get the greatest pedal kickback reduction in the system and in our opinion it's perfectly suited for all riders who want to go into a trail with full commitment, especially in the field of enduro downhill riding. In the end it's important to mention that this is just a recommendation because we are also aware of that the influence of pedal kickback could come through like different reasons. Uh, and therefore, you have the freedom to choose how you want to adjust your system and where you want to use every option of the system. But let's hear what a World Cup mechanic has to say about the system. Um, what stands out the most is the simplicity and uh, the ability to change it from one degree to another in, in no time, literally. Um, I just remember when we were first time testing and the engineer showed us how it works, we were all just blown away how simple it is. You could even, if you uh, see at the start, oh, I'm not going 20 degrees, so I want to go 10, just pull out the wheel, free hop, turn it, twist it back together, less than two minutes, so that's pretty cool. The key word for the DF system is simplicity, because no additional parts are necessary for the DF technology to function and it does not require more maintenance than a classic ratchet system. The DEG DF technology eliminates pedal kickback directly at its source in the free hop mechanism. This prevents unwanted chain tension during suspension compressions before it is transmitted through the chain to the crank where it could affect the rider. The result is improved downhill performance with natural feedback from both the trail and the bike free from the influence of unwanted chain forces. The DEG DF system is really straightforward. The rotation of the wheel during coasting combined with the minimal drag created by the spring pressure onto the ratchet mechanism forces the DF system to move backwards into reset or disengagement mode. After the DEG DF system is moved fully backwards, it is in its reset or disengagement mode. As soon as the chain is driven forward by pedaling or chain pull caused by frame kinematics, the DF system can rotate now forward by a defined degree of freedom without transmitting torque. This effectively prevents pedal kickback. So if you put the DF setting back to zero degrees, you get a normal functioning high engagement hub. When adjusted to your preferred degrees of freedom setting and as long as the system is freewheeling, it will act as an anti-pedal kickback device. Like everything is super dialed, bike feels good and I think it's definitely that new little 
improvement or advantage of getting rid of that pedal kickback when we're downhill racing, looking for all those little small little advantages in microseconds, that that hub is exactly what we're looking for so we can ride through those rougher sections faster without getting pedal kickback through the, through the pedals. Nah, never. I think I would never ride without it. 